Hello, you are welcome. Here, let's solve this nice exponent problem. From here, we have 5 raised to power x minus 4 raised to power x equal to 369. To find the value of x, we have here we can write this as 5 raised to power x, then raised to power 2 divided by 2, minus 4 raised to power x as well, then raised to power 2 over 2 as well equals to. 369. Here, yeah, same thing as we've done nothing here. 2 over 2 is 3, 1. So now let's rewrite this. Since this power multiplies on the law of indices, we can equally write it as 5 raised to the power x over 2, then square, then minus also 4 raised to the power x over 2, then square. Which is equal to 369 from here. Then in the next step, this is a letter for this. So let letter m be equal to 5 raised to the power x over 2. And let letter m be equal to 4 raised to the power x over 2. Then we can now replace this as m square minus n square equals to 369 then from here we have this in form of difference of 2 square then we can say this is n plus n multiplied by n minus n then equals to from here let's separate this as 41 times 9 then we can say that m plus n here will be equal to 41 and m minus n will be equal m minus n will be equal to 9. So we have m plus n is equal to 41 and also m minus n equals to 9. Then from here, this is 1 and this is 2 from here. So let's add these two equations. Then we have 2m then equals to 50 from here then divide both side by 2 from here we have m now equals to 25 then to get m from here we can use this the first equation that is m plus n equals to 41 then we have 25 plus n equals to 41 then we have n equals to 41 minus 25 then n here equals to 16 then don't forget we represent m as 5 raised to power x over 2 which is equals to 25 which we can write as 5 square then from here 5 we have the same base as you know 5 then that means x over 2 is now equals to 2 then this is 2 over 1 crossing multiply this is x times 1 that's x equals to 2 times 2 which is 4 so we have x equals to 4 from here then also on this side n is represented as 4 raised to the power x over 2 which is equals to 4 squared from here also same base we have x over 2 now equals to 2 over 1 then same way this will give us x equals to 4 as well. Then to check from what we have, if this satisfies the given problem, we can put the value of x back here. That is 5 raised to power x minus 4 raised to power x equals to 369. So when x is 4, we have 5 raised to power 4 minus 4 raised to power 4. Is it equals to 369 from here? 5 raised to the power 4 simply means 5 multiply itself 4 places. So that is 625 minus. Here we have 256. Is it equals to 369? Of course, when we subtract here, this will be 369, which is 369. Therefore, we can conclude from here that x equals to 4 is the solution to this given
own problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to step, subscribe for more exciting videos. Also turn the notification bell on and put your comment in the comment section. See you in the next class and bye for now.